I'm Clinton Griffiths with today's Ag Day Minute. Stocks slumping on Tuesday after President Trump warned the trade war with China could go beyond next year's election president making those comments while in the UK for a NATO summit. Mr. Trump saying he has no deadline for making a deal. I am doing very well in a deal with China if I want to make it. If I want to make it. I don't think it's if they want to make it. It's if I want to make it. And we'll see what happens. The president has threatened to impose more tariffs on China on December 15th if there is no deal. Despite the ups and downs in the trade negotiations with China, the ag barometer appears to be turning around, rising in November for the second month in a row. The survey done by Purdue and the CME Group, the index climbing to 153. That's 17 points higher than October, and it ties with July for the highest barometer reading of the year. Researchers saying it's driven by improvement in farmers' perceptions of both current economic conditions and their belief that conditions will improve in the future. Are you making more money this year? Despite the weather and tariff wars, USDA is forecasting a bigger increase in net farm income for 2019. It reports income at $92.5 billion. That's $7 billion higher than last year. Net cash farm income is up nearly 13%. USDA is saying the increases are due to a combination of lower expenses as well as increases in government payments. For more Ag News, watch Ag Day weekdays on this station or anytime on agweb.com.